in the bowels of an old power plant, this sinister plot is hatching. Ha ha! At last the time has come to hatch my sinister plot. This lever will activate my blackout generator and the world will be thrown into eternal night. Not so fast, doctors. What? <gasps> Pajama Man! That's right, Fiend. And I have some gadgets of my own. Take that! Ah, not the Illuminator Mark V! Do you have anything to say before you're sucked into my portable bad guy containment unit? I wish you'd pick up your socks once in a while. Sure thing, Mom. You can consider that done. Okay, Sam. You remember tonight's the night we go to sleep with the lights off. Don't worry about me, Mom. I'm ready. And I can put on my pajama Sam mask if I get scared. That's good, dear. Good night, Sam. Good night, Mom. There's no need to hide when it's dark outside. No need to hide when it's dark outside. I'm not scared. Darkness lives in my closet, but that's okay. I'm not scared. Okay, I'm scared. I can't sleep with darkness hanging around in my closet. I'm gonna have to capture him. This is a job for... Pajama Sam! Now where's my Pajama Sam mask? I need that and my flashlight and my lunchbox. I'm sure that my stuff's in here somewhere. Hey, one of my socks! Mom said I should pick these up. This is where I'll keep all the socks I find in the land of darkness. Nothing good under there. Oh! Here's my Pajama Sam mask. Gotta protect my secret identity. Now I just need my lunchbox and my flashlight. Hey! My signature edition all metal Pajama Man lunchbox! Who threw this away? I can keep darkness in here after I capture it. Now I just have to find my flashlight. Just a bunch of socks, nothing good. Aha! My trusty flashlight! This will help me capture darkness. Okay, I'm ready to go into my closet and capture darkness. Alright, I'm ready for action. Alright, darkness, here comes Pajama Sam! Hello? Is anybody in here? Darkness? Hello? Darkness lives all right. I better go find him before Mom notices I'm gone. Well, there's no turning back now. idea my closet was this big on the inside. Whoa! Customs, customs, Inspector. Well, 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 what have we here? Hey. Looks like a flashlight and a signature edition all metal pajama man lunchbox. Did you declare these before entering the land of darkness, young man? 
Claire? Well, no, I guess not. I, um... I think we better confiscate these items, and they could be dangerous. Hey, I need those! And you're traveling in the skies. Let's see what you really look like, hmm? My Pajama Sam mask! Pajama Sam, eh? Well, all right, then, Pajama Sam. You can go, but I've got my eye on you. <laughs> Uh-oh. Now what do I do? You can borrow that if you like. Uh, thanks. I feel bad about you losing your things. Yeah, how am I supposed to capture darkness without all my stuff? Well, I'm sure your things are here in the land of darkness somewhere. If you look around, you might be able to find them again. I hope so. I'll bring you back your rope later, okay? Good luck. Another sock! I better pick it up like Mom said. I should match up these socks. Uh-oh. I hope that nice tree's not too mad that I lost her rope. At least I got this great piece of wood. Miss Tree, um... I'm sorry, but I, uh, I lost the rope you let me borrow. Rope? Oh, that's all right. I can probably get a new one. You're not mad? Yeah, actually, it's kind of a relief not to have to hold that rope up all day long. I feel kind of bad about losing your rope. Would you like to have this piece of wood instead? Ew. Take it away. Take it away. That scary looking place up there must be Darkness's house. I'll bet that's where I'll find him. Another sock. What do you know, another sock? Hi, my name's Sam. I'm here to capture Darkness. Pleased to meet you, Sam. You can call me Otto. Would you give me a ride across the river? Oh, no! I can't go in the water, I'd sink. I'm made of wood, you know. But wood floats. No, I don't think so. I had this friend and he told me this story about his dentist brother who, um, he was made of wood and he got in the water and he sank. Really? Straight to the bottom, it's so scary. I wish I'd been a car. I think your friend was wrong. Wood floats in the water. Oh, I wish that were true. Are you sure you won't give me a lift? No, I, I can't go in the water or I'll sink. But I'm telling you, wood floats. Oh, I wish I could believe you. I think some of my Pajama Sam stuff might be on the other side of the river and I can't swim that far. But I can't float. I'm made of wood. Exactly. Wood floats in water. Yeah, right. Next you'll be telling me that birds can fly. Oh, brother. Okay, check this out. It's wood, right? Yes. All right, now watch. See? It floats. Wood floats. Yeah? So you'll float too. Go on, give it a try. I guess. Are so good. Well, here goes nothing. I'm doing it. I'm floating. Yahoo! Oh boy, this is great. Can I give you a ride somewhere? Come on, hop in. Oh, let's go sailing. Well, technically, we can't do that since I'm not a sailboat because I don't have a sail. I know what you mean, but technically you should say, let's go floating or something like that. Sure, sure, whatever you say. Let's go sailing. Okay. Oh, 
me, an old hollow log. Maybe there's a frog in it or something. Rats, there's nothing in here at all. Uh-oh, oh, I think I'm stuck. Yes, I'm definitely stuck. I wonder how Pajama Man would handle this. Jeez, nuggets. Whoa! Good day to you, fellow tree. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> 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 it's hot in there. Hey, that's my signature edition all metal pajama man lunchbox over there. Is that my Pajama Sam mask? This mask belongs to the people. It sure looks like my mask. Property is theft, man. Anyway, I need the mask to protect my identity as the leader of the Salad Liberation Front. The what? The Salad Liberation Front. We're a group of veggies fighting against the core system. We're tired of being relegated to the salad. We want to be the main course. Whatever. I just want my mask back. I'll tell you what. The other carrots are being held prisoner in the refrigerator in Darkness's kitchen. If you help me free the carrots, I'll give you back the mask. Okay, it's a deal. Great. I'll come with you to the kitchen so I can direct the operation. Okay, sure. I guess I better put my ingenious disguise back on. Whoa! Good fortune to you. Thank you, fellow tree. to cross the bridge to see what's on the other side. Don't try to butter me up. If you want to go across, you'll have to pay a toll. How much is the toll? One pound of gold. <laughs> it's an oil can. And there's some oil in it. I can't open this door. There's no knob on it. One of Dad's socks. I wonder how it got here. Whoa! Did you see that? That looks like fun. Um, sure. Fun. Right. Um, how about not right away, okay? Another sock! What did you say that thing was called? That's a geyser. A what? A geyser. It's kind of a hot spring that spurts up water and steam every so often. It works kind of like a coffee percolator. Water in passages deep down where the rocks are hot 
it's heated up to the point where it would normally turn into steam. Except it doesn't because of the pressure of all the other water on top of it. So it gets really hot and it expands and it pushes some of the colder water out of the top. That relieves the pressure and all of a sudden the hot water turns into steam and POW! It erupts out along with all the colder water on top. Then more water flows down into the deep passages and the whole thing starts all over again. Most geysers are located in Wyoming, New Zealand, or Iceland. The word geyser originated in Iceland from their word geosa, meaning gush. Geysers are usually very unpredictable about when they erupt. The most famous exception is a geyser called Old Faithful in Yellowstone National Park in Wyoming, which erupts every 64 minutes, uh, give or take about 3 minutes. It looks like this one goes off a lot more often than that. Um, thanks a lot, Otto. to that spot for years, but now thanks to you and your can oil, I'm king of the tracks again. What'd you say your name was? Sam. Well, listen, Sam, king owes you big time. Anytime you need a ride through the mines, the king will take you. I'm Relish. like one of my big brother Mark's socks. It smells like one too. So what do you know? Another sock! What are you going to do with that? You'll see. Okay, you be careful with it, yeah? By the way, what is this thing? It's a pickaxe for mine and gold. Oh, yeah. Video game. You're supposed to pick up the nuggets without crashing into anything, including yourself. Watch out for the moving rocks and hot lava.
you to be careful. Yeah, but look at all this gold I got. Since you're fabulously rich, uh, how about sharing the wealth a little? Say, let me have the small piece, huh? Deal. Darkness's house, all right. Another sock. These baskets must be the way up into Darkness's house. I weigh more than one stone. things. I bet I could fit in there. 
that's a no-no. We avow it. No, we simply can't allow it. Going down. Please, won't you open the door since I have another victim? What? I surrender, not ever await. Now I see. You'll now have captured that troublesome carabiner guy. I'll open up my door so you can put that rogue inside my drawer. Oh no, our orange leader was caught. Our fight for our freedom for not We are diminished. Completely finished. Carabiner. Hey guys. Don't you see, he's with me, and you're free to go. Free! Yes, free! Free! Uh-huh! Free! 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 Yeah. Free! Yeah. Free! Yeah. Free! 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 I almost forgot this, but you've earned it. You have taken the tide and turned it. You may take this mask and wear it. A gift of gratitude from this carrot. Hooray! I finally have my mask. Two more things and I finish my task. anymore. Hello! I saw you dancing. Bada boom bada boom bada boom bada boom bada boom. How can you guys dance to that cheesy 70s disco anyways? Just pretend you can't see me and start dancing again. Do I smell bad or something? I took a bath last week. Why did you stop dancing when you saw me? You don't have to stop dancing on my account. Just pretend you can't see me and start dancing again. How can you guys dance to that cheesy s Maybe I should turn on the music again. Well, I guess that's not going to work. All right, he's gone. <laughs> Hello, and welcome to The Brain Tickler, the game where you get to show how smart you really are. Actually, I just wanted to go through. I think we can arrange that, can't we, Wink? That's right, Blink, but you'll have to answer a few questions first, because as you know, no one can pass through the doors of knowledge without first playing... The Brain Tickler! Let's meet our first contestant. What's your name, son? Uh, it's Sam. He's Sam, all the way from, well, wherever it is he's from. His interests include skydiving, channeling ancient spirits, and stamp collecting. I don't collect stamps. You're making that up. And he'll be playing today for the right to pass through the doors of knowledge. He'll be asked questions from four categories. Once he's correctly answered one question from each of the categories, he wins. And we all know what that means, right, Wink? Step right over here, Sam, and select your first category. Our categories today are music, computer science, art, and the land of darkness. Let's try music, please. All right, here is your question. What instrument do you play by banging on it with a stick? A drum. That's correct. Wow! That's one category down and three to go. You're doing well. Go ahead and choose another category. 
Let me try computer science. All right, here is your question. What is the best computer programming language? Only a geek would worry about something like that. That's absolutely right. Two down, two to go. All right. Which of the remaining two categories would you like to try next? I'll try art. All right. Here is your question. Who painted the Mona Lisa? Leonardo da Vinci. Correct. This Italian artist painted the Mona Lisa in the early 1500s. You're really on a roll now. Are you ready for your final category? Um, uh, uh, I'll take the land of darkness. All right, here is your question. What color are the flowers in the garden on the other side of the river? Yellow. That's absolutely right. <laughs> you correctly answered questions from all four categories. That makes you the new Brain Tickler Grand Champion. Congratulations, Sam. Gee, thanks. Dom Perignon, tell us what he's won. Blink, as the new Grand Champion, Sam has won the right to pass through the doors of knowledge anytime he chooses. Isn't that fantastic? You mean I could go through right now if I want to? That's right. Wow. Thank you for being here with us on The Brain Tickler. Until next time, this is Wink. And Blink. Saying good night. Wink and Blink's wardrobe was provided by the One Coat Paint Company. The doorknob came off. I didn't do it. I barely touched it. A visitor. <laughs> well, well, well. We don't get many visitors around here. How do you do? Pretty well, thanks. How about all of you? We're fine. Thank you for asking. I'm not. In fact, I'm downright downbeat. Oh? How come? Because I ain't got no body. <laughs> what do you know, another sock? Nice view from up here. You be careful now. Even nicer view from up here. Be careful now, you, you might break something. I think I need to swing higher. Tell you to be careful. I bet Otto would like these. <laughs> Another sock. The Book of Clues. If secret doors you would go through, you must push in only blue. Whoa, that looks like a secret door. I don't see any way to open it. I think that did the trick. Wow, the 
is like a secret mad scientist lab or something. I got a sock! Visibility potion doesn't last long. Hey, I like cheese too. I've become staggeringly intelligent. All the world's knowledge is mine. I can do anything. Except lift my enormous head off the counter. Check the recipe book again. understands nothing. But how can he understand if he understands nothing? Ah! You begin to understand! Wow, I'm 
rich. <laughs> Internal Revenue Service. I'm going to have to take some of that for taxes. You can keep this moldy piece of cheese. <laughs> I wonder what this button does. Hey, look at that, would ya? Howdy, Sam. Hi, King. This must be one of those dumbwaiter things that's like a little elevator for food. I bet I could ride this one right back up to the kitchen. This must go back up to the kitchen. Going up. Wow, physics. There's no mail. Beat it. Well, all right, there's a little mail, but it's all for darkness. And it's all bills. You don't want what's in here, trust me. Oh, all right, here you go. Darkness may already have won a fabulous million dollar prize. Yeah, right. Here you go. This should be at least a pound. Alright, you're clear. Go on across. Havarti! I'm fine, how are you? No, 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 I said Havarti! Don't you know how to play cheese and crackers? Mom told me I shouldn't play with my food. Mm. No, cheese and crackers is the name of a game, see? Come on, I'll show you how to play. Hey, this is like tic-tac-toe! Tic-tac-who? No, no, this is cheese and crackers. Pay attention! First, you need to choose which you're going to be, the cheese or the crackers. The cheese, of course. Okay, I'll be the crackers. You're trying to get five of your cheeses in a row before I get five crackers in a row. I'll go first. Now you move. Now it's my turn. Now it's my turn. Now it's my turn. Now it's my turn. Let's see. 
darn you won. I'll beat you next time. Hold it! If you're planning on coming back, I'll have to stamp your hand. Oh, okay. You wouldn't believe how many people try to cheat me. Thanks. <gasps> this doorknob should fit the door. Once again, Pajama Sam saves the day with his mighty brain. These hinges look kind of rusty. I better oil them. <laughs> that did the trick. My flashlight! Now I just have to get my signature edition all metal pajama man lunchbox and I'll be all set. Okay, darkness, watch out! call it that when you can't eat it. I beg your pardon? Well, it seems very silly to call it a lunchbox when you wouldn't dream of having it for lunch. But your lunch goes in it. Your lunch goes in you, does it not? Perhaps you would like me to call you lunchbox as well. I'm not a box. Ah, too true. Watch out, darkness! Here comes Pajama Sam! What do you know, another sock? right away, okay? Why it always has to be you who reads the question. I deserve to read half of the question. It's just because I have a better... Oh, shh. It's the grand champion. 
Good evening, Mr. Grand Champion! Hi! Oh my gosh, darkness must be right behind this door! Okay, this is it! This is the big one! Alright, I'm ready! Darkness! It is I, Pajama Sam! I have come to vanquish you! Hello, Darkness? The closet! He's in the closet! Another sock! Look, I got all my socks! Mom's gonna be so proud of me! I told Mom I'd pick up my socks! Ready to go into Darkness's closet and capture him! Watch out, Darkness! Here comes Pajama Sam! Darkness? It is I, Pajama Sam! I've come to vanquish you! Vanquish? Is that fun? I'm gonna capture you and lock you in my signature edition all metal pajama man lunchbox. Oh dear, that doesn't sound like fun at all. Why would you want to put me in a box? So I won't have to be scared of you anymore? You're scared? I'm the one who's going to be stuck in the box. Oh dear, no one ever wants to come over and play fun games with me. You like to play games? Yes, but I never have anyone to play with. At night, when I come out, everybody's asleep. You mean you don't have any friends? Well, no. I like to play games. Really? Do you like to play cheese and crackers? Do I? I played it with a toaster in the park. It's great. Oh, good. We, we just need some, some, some crackers and, and some tasty cheese. Look at that move, huh? <laughs> oh, yeah? Hey, what do you know? I defeated Darkness! Ooh, I didn't see that one. You win! You're good at this, Sam. Thanks. I like this game. I better go home now, though. My mom might get worried. Okay, maybe we can play some more tomorrow night. Okay. Sam, are you all right in there? Fine, Mom. Good night. Good night, dear. <sighs> Good night, darkness. Play games? No one ever wants to come over and play fun games with me. Why would you want to put me in a box? So I won't have to be scared of you anymore? Yeah! Hmm, I think it's safe now. 
Whoa, did you see that? Mixing purple, orange, and brown puts curly locks upon your crown. Hair growth. Whoa! Whoa! Help! Woo! Wow! Ah! Yippee! Customs, customs inspection! Did you declare these before entering the land of darkness, young man? I think we'd better confiscate these items. They could be dangerous. All right, darkness, watch out. Pajama Sam is on his way. All right, darkness, watch out. Pajama Sam. All right, I'm ready for action. All right, darkness, do you have anything to say before you're sucked into my portable bad guy containment unit? Darkness? It is I, Pajama Sam. I've come to vanquish you. Vanquish? Is that fun? I'm going to capture you and lock you in my signature additional Metal Pajama Man lunchbox. What did you say that thing was called? That's a geyser. Yeah, that was fun. I think we'd better confiscate these items. They could be dangerous. 